Good morning and welcome to Mishnah Yomi, Masechus Kilayim, Paragimel, Mishnah Dalit. And hey, we'll start with Mishnah Dal today. I got my my small edition. I bought this a long time ago. I used to buy what is in the mirror. I used to buy this uh, for, the, for the ride on the tender. It's like a small little van, 20-seater van. Crazy how good it is. Crazy. Yeah, it's very good. Problem is that... I didn't have the concentration to learn it now. Baruch Hashem now, Mishnah Yomi, I get a chance to actually use it. I bought a whole set. I don't know. It was like 400 shekel, 300 shekel. So I paid like $100 for the set. So let's use it. All right. The Mishnah, um, Mishnah Dalit talks about, Anotea Shte Shuros Shel Kishu. And you plant two rows of cucumber. Shte Shuros Shel Diluim. Two uh, rows, two rows in your field of gourds, squash, Butternut squash, pumpkin, these are all types of gourds. Shte shuro shall pull a mitri. Pull a mitri is an Egyptian bean. Mutter. It's mutter to do these things. Why? Because it's once it's already considered two rows, it's considered to be a separate field. We're going to learn, and then Ian, I, I included a new shear now, Ian with Ben C on a Mishnah Yomi. We're going to discuss the Isra Mido Raisa of Kilayim. The Gemara says in Brachos and Dach Chavbez. We pass in the Yeshia that says, Lo Asra Kosa Pasi Lo Sizer Karmacha Kilayim Lo Asra Torah El Chita Sora Vicharsad Mapolis Yat. Three seeds, you throw it down together. What does it mean throw it down together? Does it mean you literally throw it down together at the same time? Or does it mean you plant it in a small area together? That will be the discussion you have been seeing. But here, and it was one of the things that you have to mix, you have to a mixture of zroim, you have to have at least two zroim and one yerek, right? A, a, a grape, chartan is a, a grape seed, so a grape plus a barley and chita. So you have to mix, uh, you have to mapolis yad, and you have to have uh, a mixture of zroim, two zroim, and a fruit, yarek, a fruit or a vegetable. Um, so the Mishnah says if you have two rows of each of them, then it makes it like separate fields, and there's no problem. Marasayin. So for sure, these are not one in my polis yacht. It's not in the same area. It's not in the same little area. It's not my polis yacht. So even though you have two zroim and you have one yarak, but they're different fields, so it's not midaraisa, and it's not even the It doesn't look like kilaim because it looks like three separate fields. Uh, Pola Mitri, again, just to figure out, Pola Mitri is an Egyptian bean. What is the significance of an Egyptian bean? So I looked this up. It's actually called the fava bean, or the broad bean. It's, it, it's actually uh, a staple in Egyptian cuisine. Uh, even until this day, rich and poor people eat it like the fava bean. Uh, you put a little oil, salt, uh, mashed up fava bean, and turmeric. You mix them up, and you have a breakfast dish. So it's a seed. You eat the seed. Uh, but you only have one row. Then it looks like one one field and the midar abana it's us. Sure, sure, sure. Sure, shavu al mitzvah. Sure, sure, sure. I'm sorry. Sure, shal kishum. Sure, shal bloom. Sure, shal bal mitzvah. Us. You have one row. It's us. Sure, shal kishum. Sure, shal bloom. Sure, shal bal mitzvah. Sure, shal kishum. Let's say you have four rows. The first and fourth row are cucumbers, and the two middle ones. One is glass. One is squash, and one is the Egyptian bean. Let's are matter. Let's is mutter because since you have the first and fourth are two rows, so therefore you combine them together. You look at them together, so it's like a field of uh, kishum, a cucumber, a cucumber field, uh, and the other two things don't look like part of the field. Come omrim, come osher. They come and say no. You have to have literally two of each one to be considered separate fields. Mishnah hey, no teya adam kishus las to guma achas. A person is allowed to plant cucumber seeds and las squash. Again, these are two vegetables, not zroim, because you eat the vegetable. Tell guma achas in one little ditch, in one little hole, small hole. As long as one is facing one way, the leaves are facing, one plant is facing one way, the leaves of the other plant are facing the other way. Again, this is not the rice. So we'll explain to you why it's not the rice. First of all, it's not three million. There's only two two Yerakos and not a zera, not a seed. Also, it might not be Mapolis Yad. It doesn't say you do it at the same time. So it's not me the rice, it's not me the rabbanan. And since they're facing different ways, so therefore it doesn't look like a mixture. And therefore, as long as the leaves are facing opposite directions, there only goes there. There only goes me the rabbanan. It looks like Kilayim here. It doesn't look like Kilayim. Have a good day.